Understanding Noise Disturbance, a guide for English learners. Hello, and welcome to our English learning series. Today, we're going to explore the phrase, noise disturbance. Understanding this term is not just about the words themselves, but also about the context in which they are used. So, let's dive in and unravel the meaning together. Noise disturbance refers to any unwanted or disruptive sound that affects someone's normal activities or well-being. It's a compound noun, combining noise, unwanted sound, with disturbance, something that interrupts or causes discomfort. This term is often used in the context of laws and regulations, especially in residential areas. Let's look at some common scenarios. 1. Loud music from a neighbor's party late at night. 2. Continuous construction noise near a residential area. 3. Barking dogs that disrupt the peace of a neighborhood. Understanding these examples can help you recognize situations where the term might be used. In many places, there are laws against noise disturbance. This is because it's not just about being annoyed. Prolonged exposure to loud noise can have serious health impacts, like stress or hearing loss. Therefore, it's important to be aware of both the social etiquette and legal aspects of noise disturbance. If you're experiencing noise disturbance, there are several steps you can take. 1. Communicate politely with the source, if possible. 2. Use soundproofing methods in your home. 3. If necessary, contact local authorities or community associations. Here are some useful terms and phrases. Decibel, dB, a unit to measure sound intensity. Soundproof, to make a room or building resistant to sound. Could you please lower the volume? I've been experiencing some noise issues. Understanding noise disturbance is not only about learning new words but also about understanding how they are used in real life contexts. We hope this video has been helpful in expanding your English vocabulary and cultural understanding. Remember, Language learning is a journey, and every new phrase you learn is a step forward. Happy learning, and see you in the next video.